Now with the Lakers, how did this happen? And what are some of the other teams you're looking at? What made you decide to stay here or go here with the Lakers? Yeah, I um, had a couple options that I could have uh, went and, and, and pursued. But um, one, of them, one of them was here. And uh, I wanted to pursue that championship. A couple guys that's in this locker room that I'm familiar with. And I wanted to be alongside with them. Who are some of those guys? Uh, of course, Trevor. You know, uh, THT. There's another one that I'm uh, real close with, AD, and uh, just a couple guys, other guys around the uh, locker room that I've met uh, during my time in the league. So, it's been we, previous. We were just talking to Trevor a few minutes ago. He called you an assassin on the court. <laughs> what do you think he means, and what do you hope to bring to this franchise? Um, he said it perfectly. I mean, the, the silent assassin. I mean, a lot of people sleep on me, but I get it done. And um, I'm just look, coming in and looking in to contribute as much as I can, bring my strengths to the game and, and go out there and win. When you talk to Rob Palenka in the Laker front office, and maybe Frank Vogel as well about coming here, what are some of the things they said that they hoped uh, to see from you when, you when you do arrive here? They just want me to be myself. Uh, they, know this, they know what I bring to the game, my strengths on both sides of the floor, and just continue to grow and get better. And I would do that here, for sure. Is it funny that just last year you were playing against this franchise in the finals and, yeah. and now you're going to be joining the Lakers? Yeah, that's, that's crazy. Crazy, crazy world, but things come full circle. They took that, that, that goal from me last year, and now it's time to get it back, though, with, with them. So I mean, I'm excited. What do, you, what do you remember about those finals? Um, I remember getting put in game one. Uh, I didn't play the, the previous series, but. Um, the final series I did play and uh, gave us a spark. I was with the Heat, obviously, and um, you know, just trying to give us a spark. I just remember losing, and that wasn't a good feeling. <laughs> yeah, that never is. Right? <laughs> right. So now, hopefully, here with LeBron, AD, and they've obviously added Russell Westbrook. How, how do you think that's going to work? I think it's going to be great. Um, some great talent, obviously, in this locker room. A lot of experience, and, and added with some youth like myself and uh, Taylor. So I think that'd be good. We get up and down and get going. So uh, it'd be great. Yeah, it's funny you mentioned the youth because some people are saying, oh, the Lakers, they've got a lot of guys over the age of 30, kind of an older team. And then they signed you. They re-signed Talon. They also got um, Malik Muck in here. Mm -hmm. Do you guys definitely feel like, all right, we got some youth on this franchise? Yeah, for sure. For sure. I got young legs. And my wheel's ready. <laughs> are you going to bring more uh, shooting or do you think you'll be uh, driving to the basket? Well, describe your game on offense for Laker fans who aren't familiar with it. Um... My game is pretty versatile, uh, to be honest, and um, so I'm a playmaker. I make plays for, for my teammates, and I score the ball, and I get out there defensively. Now, LeBron, obviously, you, know, you played for Miami for a couple of years. You missed him by, by a little bit, but I'm sure they still talk about him down there. How, how excited are you to play with him? Very excited. This is one of the best to play the game today, and I'm, I'm excited to come in and play alongside him to help win and also just to learn. You mentioned you know Anthony Davis. How, how far back does that relationship go? Uh, man, AD go back about um, maybe 10 years now. 10 years? Yeah. Um, back in Chicago playing for Main Street's AAU circuit. So he was about maybe 16, 17, you know. And I was uh, 15, 14 maybe. Okay. So about 10 years, 10 plus. Did you beat him back then? I might, I might have had some, some fair wins. <laughs> okay. You guys could catch up on that during the season, right? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Kendrick Nunn, welcome to Los Angeles. Thank you. Thank you.